As a side dish for our pinchos morunes, nothing better than some spinach. I have here some nice fresh spinach already washed, and I have here four garlic cloves already sliced, and a little pieces. And I have like about four tablespoons of pine nuts. They are going to be just wonderful. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a little bit on. I'm going to let it get hot. And then just gonna fry them a little bit with some olive oil. You know, you don't need much olive oil, you just, you just need some of it. Okay, now it's start getting warm. I'm going to get just maybe like a couple tablespoons of oil. And always use the best olive oil that you can find. You don't need a different. Okay, the oil is getting hot now. First thing I'm gonna put is the pine nut. Put also the garlic in it. Put in a spoon and let it sit a little bit. Just start frying all of the garlic and the pine nuts all together. Mm, now the garlic start boiling a little bit and bubbling with the oil. You start frying and you start smelling already the garlic. It's time to put the, the spinach. So I don't want to put them all at once because I want to fry them. So I'm just going to get some of them, like a handful, put it on top. A little bit more, okay? but not too much. Okay? And then what I want to do is I just want to flip them over, you know, so they get coated with the oil. You see? Hold them. Remember, they are going to reduce quite a bit, so we are going to have to make them all, okay? Or just a small amount. Let's try to get it there. Now that they start reducing, I'm going to get a little bit more, put it over, and over again. It get nicely coated. Reduce again, reduce again, I'm get some more, and put it over. Now I'm going to let them cook because I want all that water to evaporate. Just going to let it cook for high heat for a little bit. Okay, now that it's already reduced, I have here like about three tablespoons of raisins. They're just going to put them in. They have wonderful raisins. Mix them up a little bit. A little pinch of coarse salt. Let them cook. Very simple, very healthy, some spinach, everybody can eat those, you know, even the people who doesn't like spinach, one day they are going to like. Okay, now after about seven minutes or so, this is already ready, you know, the garlic has nice color, the pine nuts are already cooked, you can smell it, it's wonderful, you don't want to reduce it much more, and the fire up, just yes, let it aside a little later. We are going to put together a very simple couscous. This is going to be absolutely very, very simple couscous here. I have three quarter cups of this. It's the wonderful pasta from Morocco. So what I have here is I got my frying pan already hot and I have like about one large tablespoon of butter. I'm just going to put it there. Let the butter melt a little bit. Over the heat a little bit, I don't want to burn it here. And I'm just going to put my three quarter cups of couscous on it. And I'm going to fry it a little bit. You know, I set it with your wooden spoon, stir it a little bit, and I'm going to fry the pasta a little bit. I would put usually a little bit of garlic in this point too, but because I have garlic already in my spinach, I don't want to overpower, you know, too much, too much garlic flavor, you know. So this is going to be a very mild, you know, just with the butter, you know, very nice. You know? I just want to, you know, to toast a little bit of couscous. This is ready, you know? 
I have here some boiling water, so I have three quarter cups of couscous, one cup of water. So I'm just gonna measure it. pinchos marunos so if we have here our pre-wet you know bamboo sticks I'm gonna get the, the lamb and I'm just gonna go ahead and put them in I don't want to crowd too much the, the sticks okay so I'm just gonna put four of these pieces per skewer okay put it like this a little bit apart Ready? I'm just gonna get together my chicken. Go for it. 